She's around 21 years old. She loves dressing up, going out, being with her friends. She enjoys nights out, weekends away, and dinners with people she loves. But she's constantly insecure about how she looks. Hey guys, so I'm gonna show you an everyday look today. It's something that I do literally every morning. Okay, bye. She's always trying to find the right makeup to cover up what she doesn't like about her face. She's always trying to find clothes that cover up the parts of her body she doesn't like. She's constantly focused on what she looks like, forgetting to think about what she feels like. So I just finished my 30 minute session. I feel so relaxed. We're so aware of how we want our face and body to look, but we should become more aware of how we want our mind and heart to feel. The more we're obsessed with changing from the outside, we neglect the real change that is required inside. Changing from the outside looks better. Changing from the inside feels better. And changing from the inside usually results in a change on the outside too. We've all been around those people. When someone is genuinely happy, Internally, it reflects externally, so much so that it's even contagious to everyone around them. Taking care of our health, dressing well, and taking care of our physical appearance are all important, and there's nothing wrong with that, but not at the expense of developing values, qualities, and skills. When we compare ourselves to the pictures we see on social media, it's a bad idea. The pictures are highly filtered, edited, cropped, stylized. They're not even real. When you compare yourself against something or someone that isn't real, you're setting yourself up for disappointment. When we judge what we have, we forget who we are. The most beautiful thing we can wear in the world is confidence. Confidence comes from who we are, what we stand for, and why we do what we do. Again, I'm not saying don't work out or eat healthy and take care of your body. What I'm saying is don't expect that alone to make you feel better about yourself. Your diet isn't just what you put into your body, it's also what you put into your mind. If you keep saying things like, my body is not good enough, then that's what you're going to be feeding your mind. The deep work starts within. When we recognize we have unlimited potential, when we recognize we have a purpose, when we recognize that we are enough, when we realize we are enough, everything changes. We stop relying on external things to build our internal self-esteem. We have to fall in love with the sound of our feet walking away from things that are not right for us anymore. Because remember, no amount of makeup, clothes, or shoes is going to change how you feel about yourself.